Hey guys, it's Metacosis Perfect Schnellus, where medicine makes perfect sense. Let's continue the anatomy playlist. In previous videos, we talked about the hyaline cartilage, the fibrocartilage, and today it's time for the elastic cartilage. You'll find it in the ear pinna, you'll find it in the external auditory meatus, the external ear, the tip of your nose, not the cartilages inside your nose, because those were hyaline cartilages. I'm just referring to the tip of your nose. That is elastic cartilage. Back to the ear. What's the name of the tube that connects the nasopharynx to the middle ear? The answer is, this is the eustachian tube or the auditory tube. It's also elastic cartilage. Do you remember my larynx? Yes, everything in the larynx is hyaline cartilage, except the epiglottis, which is elastic cartilage. Now let's get started. Please watch all the videos in this anatomy playlist. All cartilages come from the mesenchyme, which is mesoderm. Cartilages are different from bones. Cartilages are firm. Cartilage has type 2 collagen, no vessels, that's why they have lower metabolic rate and limited regeneration capacity. Chondrocytes are the cells of the cartilage, and the matrix is not calcified. Put differently, cartilage is non-vascular, non-lymphatic, non-neural, non-calcified. Do we have calcium in the cartilage? Not under normal circumstances. But do we have cells? Yes, we have chondroplasts and chondrocytes. How about matrix? You have water, type 2 collagen, and glycosaminoglycans, and you have proteoglycans. But when it comes to elastic cartilage, we have tons of elastin in the matrix of the that cartilage. That's why they are elastic. Not to be confused with elastic supply and elastic demand that you studied in economics. Let's review collagen. Type 1 exists in bones. Type 2 in cartilage. So let's talk about yellow or elastic cartilage. If you want to learn about hyaline cartilage, it's the video before the last video. If you want fibrocartilage, it's the last video. Yellow cartilage or elastic cartilage, very flexible, very elastic because it has tons of elastin and many elastic materials. Where do I find it? External auditory meatus, external ear, the ear pinna or the auricle, the eustachian tube or the auditory tube, the tip of the nose and the tip, I mean the epiglottis, of the larynx. So when it comes to the nose, only the tip. How about every other cartilage inside the nasal cavity? That was hyaline cartilage. When it comes to the larynx, only the epiglottis. How about every other laryngeal cartilage? It was hyaline. If you like this video, you will enjoy my surgery high yields course on my website, medicosisperfectionandis.com, which has a video about ENT disorders. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, hit the bell, and click on the join button. You can support me here or here. Go to my website to download my courses. Be safe, stay happy, study hard. This is Medicosis Perfectionalis, where medicine makes perfect sense.